Hello there everybody, my name is Brandon Fair and welcome to Brand Life and welcome to a new type of video to the channel. This is going to be part of a new series I want to make, which is anime figures. Because I do like a lot of anime. Alright, so this is the figurize Frieza Final Form figure. Which the figurize, you gotta build them. So here's what the box looks like. I got it at my local GameStop. Actually, no, they didn't sell them at my GameStop. Uh, I actually had to go to the mall downtown. But I was able to pick this up. And there, I looked up online. There's actually more than just Frieza you can get. I figured that you can get Goku because he was on the case. So box me. Oh, what am I doing? <laughs> anyway, let's get to the figure. He came with a uh, changeable. Well, maybe I should just talk about that first. Oh, hold on. I don't have him on a stand. He did come with a stand, and I did not grab that. It's in the bed, my bedroom right now. Anyway, he came with a changeable face, which is this face you can use for uh, um, what was that? That just changes to make expressions. It shows on the back, like when he's firing a ray. I think it was some type of ray. Or going insane when he's throwing it, make, creating his death ball, which is right here. This is the death ball. You put put this in his wrist area. Then hold it. Changeable hands. Well, this is his finger, where you can use his death ball or death beam, which I got right on right now. And these hands are just for that one pose, you know, or just making them do like a little blast ray. Anyway, this is the figure. Oh man, let's try and get a good, good glimpse at him. Very nice figure, very light because he's you know you have to build them, and these these are actually you put stickers on too. If you ever known figure eyes, uh, my brother is the one. Uh, my, ah, sorry about that. Was but look at the camera. My twin brother is the one that um, built him, Brian Blair. So this is his figure. But uh, I think it took him over just an hour to build him, which is strange. I looked in the box, I was like, how are we ever going to build this? But you know, that's what instructions are for. So anyway, let's get to the articulation then. I say, I say he's a very nice figure, maybe a little fragile if you were wanting to play with him, but he's very, very, very good. Unless you know how to, I mean, he's, he's, he doesn't feel that breakable. He does feel a little breakable, but... If you tried hard enough, you probably would break him. Anyway, articulation has got a swivel head, and which can be removed, uh, and neck can be removed, like so. All right, let me put that back in. Very easy to put back in, actually. So, uh, I can't move him with the head without removing the neck, so that, you probably got to remove the neck first before we move that. Anyway, he's got ball joints in almost everything. I think the articulation Swivel right there, actually, but he's got ball joint shoulders. Swivel at the waist and a little bit of a ball joint, I guess. Yeah, it's a little bit of ball because you can do that, too. He's got, like, swivels right here and his legs right here. But they also are ball jointed. Legs bend. Bend right here. He's got three points of articulation with his tail, I think. Yep. Oh, four, actually. Like I said, his hands are removable, so you can switch them into a different pose. Very, very nice looking figure. I like how detailed it is. I do say though, Frieza is an overused character in DBZ, or in the Dragon Ball franchise ever since, like Super or Golden Frieza. Anyway, I do plan on getting the uh, Goku and the Cell. Well, let's just say that there's a lot of them. I think there's only six of them that you can get. Too bad they didn't make more. I would hope that they would make more. Because these are actually pretty nice figures. People, people can judge the SH figure arts as the best. Which they probably are. But those things are really expensive. And these things are really cheap online. Not at the store. I actually paid like 30 bucks for this thing. But actually, it's way cheaper. I prefer it. Recommend you getting it off Amazon. It's way cheaper, way cheaper. I forgot to tell you, it does have a swivel right here too. Let's just say he's got a ton of points for articulation. He's like, 
Oh, uh, he, like he's he's a posable figure. That's what he is. Frieza, the posable figure. Oh man, I always liked. I I fell in love with this thing because I'm a complete DBZ fanboy, and I love Dragon Ball as series. I it's my favorite anime. I'll just say that. And I haven't had a Frieza figure since my big brother had some when I was a little kid. And this is like my first in like how many years I actually having a Dragon Ball Z figure. So, expect more of these in the future. So that being said, I'm going to end the video there. So thank you all for watching. Please leave a like and subscribe. Also share it with your friend. Also check out other videos I've done here. Link down below or at the end of the video in the annotations. And I'll see you all in my next video. Peace!